Hi, Gemini. It's Lynn from Tinker Tarot. I hope you're doing well and ready for Valentine's Day and Groundhog Day and the Chinese New Year. Uh, here, we normally have Bebfest, which is our winter events. You know, we have skating competitions and hockey and ice sculptures and snow forts galore. This is like really a mild winter for us here in Canada. Um, it's very mild and there's not that much snow. So you're not going to be, you know, your fort's not going to be too high this year. <laughs> anyway, for me, for us in Ontario, anyway, I shouldn't speak for the whole country. Anyway, let's get going, see what we got for you in February, Gemini. Ooh, 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 ooh. So, I have the Druid Craft cards here today. I also have the Light Seer's Tarot and the regular playing cards. We're doing quite the combo. Most of these readings have been taken about an hour. Okay, just to let you know, because I'm doing this super big, because I kind of feel like this is the beginning of the year to me. The Chinese, I think they have it right, you know. They made the first calendar, um, them and the Mayans. But anyway, the Chinese New Year starts around the 9th, 10th, 11th. You'll have to, I'll, I'll have to look and see actually what the actual day is. But that's the real beginning, you know, and I want to do a nice, big, full reading for you. There's a card that's saying, cut it, Lynn. Cut it already. We only got an hour. <laughs> uh, I kill myself sometimes. Do you like my new dollar store glasses? These are my cheaters. Just went and got some new cheaters for like, I think, $2. It's not the dollar store anymore, right? Ooh. So, feeling stuck. Feeling there's something in your mind that's preventing you. You, 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 don't, you don't believe you're going to be able to pull this off. You don't believe it. You might be talking like you can. But in your mind, you don't know if you can do this, okay? This is what the underlying kind of energy is. So, four of pentacles in the past. The lady, which is the empress. <gasps> Oops, these darn sleeves. I hope they don't go knocking cards off. <gasps> Ace of pentacles. There could be a new birth here, a new baby. Um... Could be a new home, you know, because it looks like you've been saving up, putting some money away, um, you know, for your, your, your wanting more stability, wanting to be more stable, not feeling stable right now in your life, right? Uh, so you're, you could be putting money away, hiding, sneaking some money away because you want to start something new. You may could have something to do with the mother you know there could be a child coming or this could be just a new baby uh, a new home i get the idea of the new home i see the bear here protecting the honey hole protecting what he considers as his this is mine you know and and because this little lake or or whatever water source is a, it, it provides him with all the fish he needs to survive you know he could just stay here and live for quite a long time it's the ace he's just found the spot you've just found a a spot i think and so anyway it seems like something new is happening with this like I said, the underlying energy here is though you're not thinking you want to pull something off. You also may want, you know, you could see this empress. Okay. You, you could be this empress. Okay. This could be you or what you're seeking. 
what you're saving up for, what you want to invest in, okay? You could, this could be a person and you see this person as, you know, nurturing Mother Earth herself, you know, like just, just really uh, plentiful, full of abundance in a lot of different ways, you know what I mean? Uh, she's not just a baby maker, but she has a beautiful house and garden and, and seems to have a way with people and, you know what I mean? Like lots of gifts. She's abundant in that way. And she wants to spread her seed. She wants to share her abundance, you know, so that others can feel this way, can learn how to share, yada, yada, yada. But, you know, this is this is almost feeling protective of that that source of abundance source of abundance so let's see what else is going on here gemini you have the three of pentacles that makes sense after the ace here you know this new beginning the lord <gasps> right under the lady the lady then the lord Wow, the Lord is the center of your reading. So the Lord is about the emperor, the one that's running the show, the boss, the landlord, the um, maybe even the father, you know, because he very much represents the father figure, the one that's in command, control, makes the decisions, you know, uh, this could be you. Gemini, you could be the boss, the landlord, the, uh, perhaps you're thinking about buying a place where you could rent out a union, then you would be the landlord and, and it would be a source of income, like a source of abundance, right? You know, that could have that angle on it. Uh, you could want to do it with this person. You see, you, you know, a future with this lady, this empress. Or you can vice versa these two, right? But anyway, um, I'm going to tell you, too, the Lord protects his feelings. He doesn't really uh, show those, you know. You can see this Lord has his heart covered by this armor. You know, it's, it's the only armor he's wearing. He's not really afraid to face anything, to deal with anything, except when it comes to do with the heart. You know, he's got the armor around the heart. You're not getting to my soft side, because I've got to make tough decisions here, okay? This is the way this guy rolls, right? So, um, somehow, I think he, or you, if this is you, have this new you could have your own business or your own something you're starting you know you're putting your time and energy in trying to make a mark for yourself here right justice uh you could be dealing with a legal situation something that you got started you know something that you saved up for right like you've been saving up putting money away planning planning um and so there's something that you made you built or something that you're going to get justice for some sort of okay uh in the future you have the chariot so that's really getting control over the two sides your two opposing forces and we all have them you're not alone Okay, we all have those two opposing forces and we got to we got to get them working together. You know what I mean? Or you're always zigzagging. Ten of Pentacles and nice, nice. That's really cool because, you know, here's this line. Like I said, you see a future. I knew it with the lady up here. The, the the goddess the mother earth the abundant one okay you see a future but you don't know how to get it you don't think you're going to be able to pull it off you don't see a way um you don't see a way okay but this is what you want this is what you're trying to create this um you know that 
comfort, that family feeling, that play, the home, you know, home. And in another way, but I think this has a lot to do with home for you, um, Gemini. Uh, you have the um, the temperance here too. They call it the ferulet in this deck. And it's about concocting a recipe, trying to gain some balance in your life. Isn't it interesting that here you have the Ten of Pentacles, right? So here's the Ten of Pentacles. This is to achieve this, okay? This is what you're starting to get, what you're starting to understand. Because I'm going to tell you right now, the Lord has mastered all the lessons of all the other kings. He's figured out his mind, you know, he's figured out his heart. He's, he's figured out his passion and his, um, you know, his stability, his, his, he's, he's, he's got himself real grounded here. He's mastered them all. Like, look, he's got the air, he's grounded on the stone. He's got the biggest staff and the, the horns, you know, you can hang all your coats on that. <laughs> all your hats hey you can hang all your hats he's a man of many hats so there you go right and here um this guy looks bored because it seems like there's a a, a a level of achievement here right but at the same time it's wanting to do something new just having that uh that thirst for something new for change for variety there's boredom here but i think that there's also such a level of comfort security feeling you know like you have people who love you and look up to you around you they see you as the lord the father the boss the one that knows, you know, that you, that you, we have a certain amount of faith in the Lord, right? Certain amount of faith in our father, certain amount of faith in the boss and the landlord that they're going to take care of things. They know what they're doing. You know, we can depend on them, rely on them to look after us, right? So... But on either side of this Ten of Pentacles, where you're trying to get to, right? Because up here, you, here's the Ace and here's the Four. Put the money away for it. You're trying to get here. But on either side, what you're realizing, both sides are to do with balance. Okay? So this is balancing your 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 light side and your dark side because you can be very giving and helpful and um um loving but you can also be very nasty and you know isn't that gemini right <laughs> you know you can swing back and forth and you don't gemini's don't swing as fast as some others you know when they're pissed they're pissed for a bit they hold on to that for a bit. Takes them a while to start going in that direction, to change direction. But this is what you're getting control of now, because you're the you're the Lord. You're the you're the the leader, leading by example. You know, uh, you can't let everybody everybody else go running around with their thing chip on their shoulder. So you can't do it either. Right. And and then this balance over here is more about um, your, you know, what you give to yourself and what you give to others. So it's more about taking care of yourself. This is re this is reconciling your two sides as far as um your fair your fairness you know how fair you are and what you're willing to do and what lengths and stuff and this is more about care you know self-care um and also giving to others you know going after what you want but also respecting what you have it's like that that careful balance of not getting stuck in either place really 
You don't want to get stuck over here or over here. You want to use both to your advantage, right? So this is the thing here that you're trying to achieve in this 10. So let's, let's move on. Let's add some clarification. So tell me in the past, what's going on for Gemini? Oh, oh, okay. Well, I'm going to tell you those ones want to come for sure. Let's see what they say. Ah, see? Temperance. Exact same. Farlet. Temperance. Trying to get that balance. There's a, it's a, there's a spiritual part of that. There's, it isn't spiritual in the chariot. It's about action. Getting control. Like enough is enough. You know, um, really focusing. You know, the, 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 the chariot is more about focusing. Whereas the temperance is um about forgiving you know and trusting and you know it's that spiritual side of gaining that balance like not having I, I, you know it's letting go of like resentments and fear and hate and all that stuff um it, it's a bit of enlightenment in a way you know, it's a bit of enlightenment. It's kind of like the Hierophant a little bit. Um, but, you know, because again, in, in the, in the Feralit, in the Temperance, you can't stay in either world too long where you're, you know, you just take care of yourself and you don't go out and, um, be part of the wheel, right? And so, but you can't be out there in the wheel all the time. All work and no play makes Jack a dull boy, right? So it's that balance, that careful balance of what we give and what we take and all that. And then you have the Knight of Pentacles. And this is about action. Taking careful action, slow action. He's not even on his horse. He's walking in front of it. Um, wants to see what's what's up there first before he commits the the knight is taking action and moving forward to it but it's careful you know careful and four of swords so the four of swords is healing resting um time out kind of thing perhaps um this is why the progress is so slow gemini because there's this time out happening right now, right? We're, we're waiting for, um, you know, everything to settle down in the world. It's just still so bizarre that every single one of us are experiencing this same thing together. It's very rare occasion, you know, that the whole world experiences something together, but Oh, I need my glasses. So, you know, and this is why you're going to take advantage of this time. You're going to rest. You're going to get your rest. You're going to try and get some balance in your life. I also think you're going to try and get outside, get active. You know, this Knight of Pentacles, I think, is about getting outside, getting back in touch with nature, getting active, going for walks, whatever that might mean for you, it's part of your nurturing, your self-nurturing, okay? Okala dokala, Gemini. So, what's going... <laughs> Did you see that? What's flying? <gasps> so, I was going to say, what's going on with this emperor? So, there's some sort of regret here, okay? Something... This is like an empty victory, a fight. You know, you won this fight, but you lost what you lost is greater than what you won. Okay. Um, so there's something you lost here. There's something you're, yeah. And gone. This is why I said, remember you, it's like you put some energy into something and there's going to be some justice out of this. Uh, you may have to deal with the Lord, the landlord, the boss, the father, 
uh, in a situation to get law to get your justice uh, but you lost something so that must might be what the justice about is about to get your justice out of the situation because you lost something here it's also a victory though but i think that there could have been there's something lost yeah yeah definitely you're feeling lost you feel alone left out um like you don't have you feel left out like you're not included or something like this you also may not feel like you have enough money or the right stuff to get in to gain access to what you want okay the key is sitting there but yet you're too um wrapped up in your sorrow about what you've just lost you're really wrapped up in your loss right now there's something that you need to forgive to let go probably yourself okay probably yourself there's something that you do need to let go of here because i could see that in the in the chariot here you know and also in the temperance there's also in this eight of swords yeah there's something you need to let go if it's in you nobody else can do it blame shame whatever it is and because you're holding on to regret um it's feeling alone feeling left out it's a bit of a woe was me you know i'm sorry I, i'm sometimes i have tough love gemini so it could be a bit of a woe is me and you're gonna let go you're gonna free yourself all from from that and it is gonna feel very freeing because it weighs you down more than anything else it's an it's this 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 uh ball and chain you da drag around okay of the this regret this loss you know and you need to celebrate what you have gemini you need to be thinking celebrating look at what what i've been gifted with look at here okay um you have yourself you know first of all you've made it through life this far you've made it through all this mess that we've been going through this whole time so there's things to look at the glass half full this is what you gotta look at you gotta look up you gotta look beyond um and there's a lesson in this for you okay the lesson in this for you one of the lessons that just came to me is don't hold too tightly to material possessions don't hold too tightly that's one of the lessons you're meant to learn here gemini it's about the material world you're supposed to get back to nature somehow you're supposed to get you're you're being pulled to nature to yeah somehow what else here is here at the end of february for for um gemini there could be a pisces around you i'm gonna tell you i almost just said pisces just now i don't know <laughs> i have no idea why but there could be a pisces um is there anything else for gemini at the end of february so there is the three of pentacles just like this so this is starting again starting again you might um invest in something with a couple other people you know you could start a new business new project move in i'm thinking this is um doing something you know what it reminds me of a band you, i don't know why i don't know why i thought of that right now but right there i thought of a band you know each plays a different instrument not you can't have three drummers right so each plays a different instrument each uh, uh, um uh puts something different into the mix and it makes music okay it makes a music movie that's not my phone that's the farmhouse phone you're hearing dr bombay dr bombay please come right away all right the call that's the call gemini 
and it could be with an earth sign there's that earth energy again eh that like i said that the lady the empress the the queen of pentacles is very close this could be male though as well so male female could be an earth sign taurus virgo capricorn um quite often gemini teams up with um with virgo okay eh? that's a very common com combination but this woman or the or you because this could be you in this energy now gemini are are happy with the the simple creature comforts of home and so is this guy if you look at him right he's so happy with the creature comforts of home the simple things in life and it's very much about this energy she's grounded she's she only has one chair she she likes that chair she's happy in that chair you know she's satisfied and content with everything she has she realizes the simple pleasures in life and is quite content with it's like a minimalist this makes me think of she does not him that's not this necessarily because this is kind of like having it all you feel like you have it all here right and and this is kind of minimalist energy where it's it's that feeling of having it all without having it all what is it all right what is it all is there anything else here for gemini you got anything else for me you have it do you have it though i think that might be it right there okay oh we i like it i like it six of wands this is victory success you're gonna get what you want you know i think you need to be patient maybe not one of your virtues gemini patience but it's almost suggesting that with this earth energy all over the place patience just walk there what's that joke about the bulls going down to to mate with to mate with all the cows <laughs> Uh, this you know patience and also realize that you need others we need others we can't play all the instruments ourselves right uh, there could be an earth sign earth energy around you motherly figure and a victory victory with what you're going to do and also victory with the simple pleasures you know I think there's some sort of ah uh, i'm getting a feeling of place in the country really getting a feeling of that um and also very simple simplistic realizing what what you need and what you don't need really you know okay so last but not least my pudding babies are the playing cards i got the horsies horsies you know what, what's weird as all my life, well, I shouldn't say all my life because I don't know where it switched or if it's just happening here. But most of my life, I am like deathly allergic to cats, hay, horses, grass, trees, like everything environmental pretty much. And um, when I came here, when I came here the first time, I uh, I don't know if you remember, there weren't horses here last year. He just got them in August. And you know what's amazing? I don't get sick. And there's a cat in this house, and I don't get sick. But I can go up and pet these horses and kiss them and play with them, and 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 I don't get sick. I might cough maybe a little bit, but before... I would have like like a non-stop running nose. I couldn't I couldn't stop all the stuff that was coming out. I was so sick for days after. And it's just magic. It's magic. So we don't we're not always the same. We change, we evolve. And even our system does. Like I thought I was going to have those allergies right to the end. Like I thought I'd never be able to touch horses. And I can't. So I'm just saying anything is possible, right? 
Ooh, it could be some sort of health issue. Uh, there could have been. I'm almost getting the, the the feeling maybe an accident. There could have been an accident. There could have been something happened where um, it created uh, a scare. Anyway, uh, for sure, it could have, it could have ended. You could have had to go to the hospital, or um, I don't know if it's anything necessarily you did, but it's something around you that caused a problem. Okay, big problem and a big um, a challenge, a barrier to what you had kind of going. You know, you kind of had something going there. Uh, what else do we have for Gemini, February 2021? Tell me all about it, my babies. Okay, we have a very dark-eyed woman. Could be a man, too. This is very dark brown or even black eyes. Could have dark features, black hair, black skin, or just like, um, like Hispanic, maybe Asian, but it's in the eyes for sure. They could have dark hair as well. Um, this accident could have, or whatever this is here, could have something to do with this dark eyed person. All right. Um, they, they could have had some sort of accident. Yeah. Everybody's talking about it. Everybody's a talking about it. Tell me what's going on for Gemini. Lots of talk. Lots of talk. But this is money talk now. This is money talk. I think this is about your justice now, right? Um, money talk. uh yeah you could get some sort of um money back or retribution but there could be sentimental things that you lost um because there's loss here eh? in the present in the kind of mid-february so you feel loss of some sort uh you may be getting money back a refund or something but it's not the same as the stuff this is what the lesson is. Do not hold too tightly to material things. Okay. That one. Three of diamonds. Woo. I like that one. So, you know, you're getting your karma back. This is, and it's not bad karma. You know, I think you were doing the right things. I don't think this is your mistake. I don't think this is your, you know, it just happened it happened around you to you someone you know maybe um and that could be you that queen of spades that has the dark eyes there gemini i'm not sure could be could be i usually see that person is single not by choice uh separated divorced widowed perhaps um chip on their shoulder remember i was saying that somewhere here chip on their shoulder you know it, it doesn't get them anywhere this um sometimes it's hurt too they wear their pain you know you can see it on them they wear it and so sometimes you know some of the this could have to do with that this person wears their pain or or you do gemini is there anything else for gemini here tell me this is so wonderful this is really good talk about money getting getting um reward not rewarded but so, there's some money coming to you okay um you're getting some money back what you, it's what you want you're happy who are you ever happy about it might be more than what you want uh this this is like really happy you're able to now move forward with some of your plans the ten of hearts is joy you know joy tell me about the end of february for gemini that's so nice what a turnaround from the beginning or from the past what's happened in the past already this bad move this accident this pain pain 
tell me in, tell me at the end of February what's happening for Gemini, Gemini, my baby, baby, four clubs, new foundation, new foundation, decision, you, this is a, now, you know, it's kind of cool because it's like you you have a decision to make. Where do you want to go? You need to pick a direction. All right. It's nice to have the options. Wow. Oh, my God. Did you see that? Just about all the cards filled right out. Wow. Great moves ahead. Look at that. You know um also some sort of business you might be thinking about uh starting it could be a home business you could be thinking about doing and i also see the king of clubs has flipped over i'm only going to take the card that flipped over because there's so many that fell the king of clubs we have a queen of hearts over here also and an eight of spades. So you could have words with a blue-eyed woman or blue-eyed man. Um, you might have some sort of dispute or it could be disagreement. You just disagree with them and you may have to renegotiate. Um, not You're not accepting something. Okay. There's something you're not accepting here. All right. Um, but it's in this, you know, it's in this you're you handle things better now you know you're not the queen of spades anymore you're the queen of hearts now you know you handle things better you're able to deal with a, a dispute or a difference uh, softer you, you can deal with it very softly now okay um so i think there's you need to make some sort of decision about your home you you want to make a new foundation start laying down a new foundation and you and i think you've found something or where you want to move to take steps to you could even be moving in with someone sharing a place here because this makes me think of two taking steps together partnership not necessarily love but partnership at the very least and then i also see some sort of home business perhaps here um something that could be really long lasting and to do with now business now what's you know up and coming now happening now and it could be with a king of clubs this could be male or female uh brown or hazel-eyed person this person's really friendly they're really good at uh business you know they have a an eye uh 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 an insight or something into it um they are and they know how to manifest they know how to put things into action you know take your idea and allow okay let's execute it okay let's make it happen as kirk says engage <laughs> anyway gemini how interesting eh? i want you to let me know in the comments below if this resonates for you look at that i'm 40 minutes that's pretty good that's way better so uh don't forget to like share and subscribe and this ad free video is brought to you by aquarius this month it's their birthday and their time to send in their annual $25 contribution to my channel that represents a dollar per video if you'd like to know more about it it's in the description box below also if you see an Aquarius say happy birthday all right love you babies bye